and 10% even, make sure you read the instructions, attempt it on your own. Let's go over the answer now. So we want to write our method percent even, accepts an array of integers as parameter, and returns the percentage of even numbers in the array as a real number. So we're gonna use a double here. So we're given an example as well, so make sure you read over that. So for a percentage, what we're gonna want to do is we take the number of evens that we have, and we are going to divide it by the length. It's just that simple. We do have to do a check though. If it has no elements, we are just going to return 0, 0.0. If it has no elements, it's zero. Um, what I'm going to do is divide by array length. And if it's zero, that's going to give us a zero exception. So we do have to make an actual check for this. So if our ARR dot length is equal to zero, we just return a 0, 0.0 since it's a double. Otherwise, we're going to be inside of here and we want to increment a counter and this counter is going to store how many evens we have. So we'll just do double even is initially equal to zero. We'll have a for loop and a starts at zero. This is just some arbitrary value. ARR dot length and we are running this for a plus plus. Now inside of here, we are going to want an if statement. So if and this is going to check if it's even or not. If our element at the a index is modulus 2, if it has a remainder, that means it is odd because we're dividing it by 2 and it should be 0. So if it is equal to 0, we'll just have even plus plus. We're going to eventually want to return our value. So return our even divided by our ARR dot length. And remember, um, index is 1 minus length. So ARR dot length minus one actually that's wrong we want the length <laughs> not the index a little bit tired right now but so we have our even value right here we want the we want the actual length like that that's correct we don't care about the index when we're doing like mathematical like this so we are going to have our ar dot length it's my apologies again and we want to multiply this by 100 so the 100 is for the percentage Multiply this by 100, pressing submit, passing 9 out of 9 tests. That is how we would do this problem. I am very tired, my apologies. So pass 9 out of 9 tests, exercise 7.10% even. Super cool, and that's how we would do it.